morning guys, hope you're well. I'm Claire and I'm Naked PR Girl. Today I've got the organizing lady coming to see me because I'm gonna be looking at storage and how to organize my wardrobe so that it doesn't stress me out. Um, at the moment, obviously, we're kind of going back into lockdown so you don't need so much stuff, I guess. Um, but over the years, I've let things really get on top of me. Um, I'm not the best at getting rid of things. I tend to buy things and then love them forever and try to get as much wear as possible out of them. So for me, like getting rid of something is quite difficult difficult and I attach things to different parts of my life and then I get overwhelmed though so it is time for a change it's time for a cleanse it's time to move on so I'm really looking forward to it and getting a handle on it and there's probably a lot to go through from my side and hopefully she'll help me with how to physically put it all in so I can actually find it and use it and deal with all my shoes. Right, so today what we're doing in Claire's wardrobe is we're just going through everything and just making sure that it's stuff that she's gonna wear. For instance, we've kind of decided that she's um, gone into a different phase of her life and things like this are not gonna be included and they're not going forward with her, which is good. And then we've been kind of discovering some old favorites that she sort of probably hasn't been wearing. Things like this pencil skirt, which is gonna look really super cute on her. And she can team that with lots of things that we've just found. Um, okay, so the other thing we've done is um, all of the knitwear has gone on to hangers like this. These are really inexpensive, £2.49 for five from TK Maxx, can you believe it? So I brought some of these with me and we've just kind of put all the knitwear on so that you're not gonna get those horrible little marks in the shoulder. So if you're trying to stack your drawers and you're doing it like this, it always makes it more difficult. If you turn your box like that, immediately gravity will be on your side and you'll probably get probably two to three more things in, particularly when you're in limited space situations. That's a really good tip. So when you're hanging trousers, um, if you look at the trouser and if they go like that and the crutch is facing out, it always makes the wardrobe look really untidy. Whereas if you hang your trousers, this is for gents or for ladies trousers, if you hang it that way, you get a really nice straight line. Okay, so today what we've done, um, because Claire has such limited space um, and also she hasn't got a lot of hanging space, we've hung things, so all of the jumpers have gone on to um, hangers hung all of these together on this side and behind them are all of her jackets and then on this side um, we've made it all of her dark clothes her longer dresses now what we've done with some of them particularly the ones that aren't wrinkle um, prone we've just tucked them up into the top which has given her a little bit more space here and also gives the feeling of just being a bit more open which makes a space immediately increase So tell me about how you feel about today and what's happened. I feel very cleansed. <laughs> Literally, it's echoing. It's so good. It's like been, yeah, it's very therapeutic. Yeah. I just want to get it out of here now. Like, just take it to charity shop, move it on. Yeah, it's been really... And so a big change in the bedroom as well, where... Big change. Big change. I just can't believe how much you can do in such a short space of time. This would have taken me... Well, has taken me years <laughs> to do, and you've just, like, done it like that. I mean, it's magic, isn't it magic? It is, it's just fresh eyes, I think. Oh good, I'm really glad that you're pleased. Yay! <laughs>